Yo, 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 welcome back to the Only Hip Hop Show with the Only Hip Hop Squid of the Night. Squad. Squad. Hey, y'all, 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 y'all messing up. God damn. Welcome back yeah. to the Only Hip Hop Show with the Only Hip Hop Squad. Squad. This is the only one and only execution of Ron oh. Pierce. And the building we got. Executioner. <laughs> what does that mean? What's good? <laughs> what does that mean? What's good, world? <laughs> It's your man, Rachel Falon, a.k.a. Rap Genius. Oh, yeah. I'm in a very good mood as far as life is concerned, That's as far great. as hip-hop is concerned, as far sure, as hip-hop. sports is concerned. Yeah. Just when LeBron thought he was going to um, avoid oh, the big bad wolf, yeah. Golden State came back. Our shoulders are getting bigger, baby. <laughs> for another L in the finals. We can hold this pressure. Then the hip-hop gods blessed us with Pusha T yes. and Jay-Z. That's two weeks in a row, Hov. Two Thank weeks you. in a row. I knew Hov was in the layup line last week. That's why I kind of excused that all the he way up verse. Line. But he did make up for it with an incredible verse that he dropped incredible. today. Check that out. Am I whack for not listening to it yet? You're very whack. Right. <laughs> Do you have titles? I'm going to pitch it right to you. You're only so you whack can... if you don't have titles. I don't have titles. Oh, yeah. So I'm whack. whack. No, it's, on every, it's everywhere. I didn't even listen to it on titles. So mm. It's no excuse. I just haven't, you know, I got to sit down and really like. What's your name, it. non Jay Z fan? Excuse me? Introduce Jay-Z yourself. Uh, Did you say non? Non Jay Z. Man, every Jay Z fan I know. All the way up. At least most Elevator of Elevator will never a, take us a down. 1996. To current JT fan, you know this. Let's not start. We'll be all night. All the way. Hi everybody, Chrissy B. Chrissy B. I want to um, make an announcement that NinaDeuce.com will be dropping some apparel. So yes, huh. yes. merch. Are y'all ready for the merch? For the hey, merch. Big and tall or nothing. I got you. All right, cool. Hey, you got an authentic Crenshaw. Because I'm a Crenshaw like, alumni. That's before they start making them Class in of the in marathon store. <laughs> I went to Tap. They stole my 7:30 at Crenshaw. I should. Oh, you couldn't handle 30s. the pressure? <laughs> no, my <laughs> mom couldn't handle the pressure, bro. I'm just uh, a bitch. <laughs> Shout out to my nigga Floss in the building. Hey, you feel me? The wet flu game. It, re- it was really a hangover I game. I got my chocolate thighs on, The league had to I call it a flu coming. game. <laughs> MJ was out there with a hangover. I heard somebody poisoned his pizza. Nah, that's what they want you to do. Somebody believe. poisoned his pizza. Hey, man. <laughs> he got sick. Do your research on Michael Jordan and how much of a uh, N-word he was. I just want to thank Michael Jordan for being one of the greatest ever and to inspire hey, me. But we also at the same time want to say fuck Michael Jordan to a certain extent for saying fuck rap. Because he did say man, Michael Jordan can say whatever he want to say. Except rap that. ain't his no. lane. That, Except right. for that. Basketball that. is his lane. Hip hop nah. ain't his lane. Disrespecting man. Shout out to Chance the Rapper, man. Let's Shout out to Chance the, the fuck. fucking Rapper. The coloring book, god damn it, man. Yeah. You didn't have to do it like that. Chance 3 is amazing, man. He made it free for us. And every bar is hard, god damn it. Just like he That's said on Pablo, man. Uh... Like, speaking of Pablo, LP, hold on, man. That <laughs> Kanye song? That uh... video? That was one of the best songs I, I didn't heard my entire time being on this goddamn hip hop show, bro. So I want to thank you first and foremost for bro. giving me that experience. Before we even bring you on, we're uh, not even no, gonna bring him on yet. We got a segue now. God damn, man. Compton DB. I love, I love. God DB. Yeah. Hey, thank you, man. I truly appreciate it. Taking the crown. That's over, a fresh ass that. jersey, by the way, too, bro. <laughs> What was that? I said, I said that's a fresh jersey, by the way. Oh, thank you, man. You know, I try to try to keep jersey, it different. Uh, <laughs> says the man with the with the Cavaliers hat on. Oh, hey. <laughs> What's up, LP? What do you do, baby? <laughs> okay, here's um here's a here's a thing. Okay. Um, Execution. as we going in uh all six almost six all summer sixteen. Mm-hmm. Hey. So uh, here's the thing about uh. Their chance to rapper coloring book situation. Uh, so perfect. I couldn't get into it. it what? Oh, I'm sorry. I just couldn't get into don't, it. Don't be that guy. Okay. Okay. Don't, don't, <laughs> I couldn't get into it. And two, before we get to the DB's interview, we got a caller on the line. Hey, who is that? Is it Dane Diesel? What up, Dane? Call on the line with the only hip hop show with the only hip hop squad with DB. And squat. What's your name? Where you calling from? Hello. You Hello. good? You on the air, baby? What it do? Hey. Yo, what's poppin'? Oh yeah, yeah man. <laughs> you sound fake. Yo, is D is D Lou on right now? Oh no, he on nah. deck. You gotta stay tuned. I mean you gotta stay tuned, man. Yeah, this is a drummer, man. I'm just saying what's good. I appreciate y'all getting them on and all hey, that. Your hey, drummer you sound call. like you off the turtle time like this. It's your drummer <laughs> on the line. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. Right on, Hey, you gotta watch the whole show now, man. You can't hit no buttons. Right. Roll no, up, I man. Got <laughs> you. Yeah, man. I got right. you. I want to see Stay tuned, good. man. We got Compton DB in the building, baby. Hey. 
Hey, run this show. Shout out to Dane Diesel, man. We miss you. Get well soon, God. You already know. Jersey. Prayers and much love, clarity, understanding. Squat. Hey, Shar, you you running point with that ugly jersey you got on, man. <laughs> So let's run, baby. Let's get it. Uh-huh. Yeah, before we do that, we got another caller. And oh, we going? Uh, come on, Another caller. Party. If you on the air with the only hip hop squad, with the only hip hop squad, squad. with DB in the building, what's your name? Where you calling from? What up, man? Thank Diesel. Thank Diesel, man. <laughs> I hear that sexy voice you got on. Oh, oh, bro. Bro. I hear you. I was doing so well. I apologize to everybody. I got a little migraine and took a little aspirin, and I don't know what they're putting in them jars nowadays. Michael J. Ooh. Oh. I just woke up, man. Literally, this all this action, action. So big shout out to Compton DB. Big shout out to Gary Lou. I appreciate y'all for stopping by, coming through. You got yeah, the Instagram popping. Y'all looking good on that. Uh, Crenshaw, I see you, Lakers. I'm, I'm, I'm looking good, or, or are we looking good? Are we looking good, or we? Single we out, man. Two thirds of us is looking good, bro. <laughs> hey, Dane, look, man. Well, I promise we will hold you down. If you have a migraine, that means you need to roll up. FYI, I'm not a doctor. But... No, Dane. After the show, get some rest. Oh, oh yeah, my bad. I see you, big shout out, uh, Christy B. I, I saw you and I got the missed call from you. Big shout out to Compton DB. I mm-hmm. see you out there. Yes, big shout out to Big uh, Thank you, bro. Dane, Dane, how you feel about that Kanye song, man? How you feel about that Kanye song? Hey, bro. To be exactly. Perfect, you right now, my mind is still a little scrambled. So I'm going to give you that commentary when I see you. That's enough said, man. I'll wait to see you on the block, baby. Right. Get well soon. Hey, no more. Hey, well, y'all hold it down. Big shout out to the lovely uh, Lord, the publicist. Big shout out to Compton DB. Big shout out to Derek Blue, the whole squad. Man, I love y'all. Y'all look at the main one out here from uh, my view, uh, man. Uh, and y'all stay strong out there. I'll be in touch. Yes, sir. Yeah. All right, let's get to it. Oh, I let's miss get that. to it. So on you. We going to the break or we straight in? We straight in, post. Yeah, that's Compton DB, talk. man. What's up with it? Welcome to the neighborhood. Welcome to the squad, man. Hey, man, I appreciate being here, man. Yes, Many sir. times I've been to that Roscoe's over there. Huh. I, I mm-hmm. ain't even know this is over right. there. We love you. Roscoe's hint, hint. <laughs> no, bro. Hey, introduce your guy right here, real oh, quick. Oh, he yeah, don't need no introduction. Yeah, yeah, he don't know. miss him, though. <laughs> He's good everywhere. This is Hawk. You know the fam is For the, the people that I don't know Oh my right, man Oh my bad He, he, he was the CEO That looked like the bodyguard Share my seat He's gonna share my seat With me and shit hey, The one that conducts The business man. The fam is in the building Right what what Hey what before, we, before we Before we get to this interview We got a call We got some callers okay. On the line Ooh, that we, we have to pick I think it's for DB For right now So uh Love man Caller what's your name You're calling from This is the only hip hop show With the only hip hop squad 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 This wife coming from Compton Oh yeah Wow. Stop City, Compton Zoo, what's up? Where's Wes? Hey, I smell your feet, dog. <laughs> <laughs> How you going to tell me what my nose is smelling? A little hand size. <laughs> That's right, yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, Compton Zoo is this thing, man. DB doing this thing, man. We love all the music, man. Everything we get from that guy, we do it. We love it. Hey. We play it. It's a heavy rotation every time. I appreciate you, man. Yeah, we, we need more from you. I need, I need you know, the next project. I'm... I'm trying to get, I'm looking for some bonus tracks on this season. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got no I got you. I got you. Blessing us, dog. We love it. Hey, man, thank you. I appreciate you, bro. All right, man. Yeah. Hawk, what you have to do with that Kanye song, man? You know, you know my vibe, man. You know how I fan out sometimes, yeah, man. Yeah, I like that lit. goddamn song, man. What you have to do with that? I gotta keep it all the way. Yeah. What, what was the secret, man? What's up? You know, DB did his motherfucking thing on that. All the way. All the way. I, didn't, the way. I didn't. I had nothing to do with that at all. When I came in, you know, DB said, uh, "Hawk, I got something for you." He pressed play, and I said, "Whoa." Man. If I get a woe out of you, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> All right, now, DB, I got a question for you, bro. <laughs> What's up? All right, now, like the average artist would have felt like it was dick riding, or they would have felt like they would have felt worried about other people's perception, like just being so vulnerable, vulnerable, and so vocal about your appreciation for Kanye. Right. Like, yeah. what made you just say, "Bump that"? I'm gonna just express myself the way I want to. You know what? I I think. Uh, when a person is comfortable in their own skin, they don't have no problem with showing love to Period. anybody. Period. You know what I'm saying? I just give respect where respect is due. Period. You know what I'm saying? And I appreciate what he's, you know, what he's done for the culture mm-hmm. in terms of just pushing us forward and being able to say, hey, hmm. like I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try this. 
I'm getting ready to sample this. I'm getting ready to start singing. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people, he got a lot of flack for 808s and Heartbreaks, but that was innovative hey, at right, that time. You know right. what I'm saying? But I think that was one of his dopest works. Yes, you know what I'm saying? So I, I really appreciate what he does. And like I said, man, you know, my mom always taught me, like, yeah, you're comfortable in your own skin and, it, you know, and you ain't got nothing to worry about. Yeah. So that's just how Be I feel. Be on my team with this, man. And let's attack this guy, all right? <laughs> how do you feel about Yeezus, man? You know what? Come on, man. I'll tell you this. <laughs> In the words of the great Hove. Okay. What? Hove said, Yeezy is going to be the first one to try whatever. Mm -hmm. right. So he'll go over the mountain with, against all the Indians yeah. and come back and say, hey, yo, it's a lot of Indians lot over of Indians. here. Now, now, before you, before you, because I, I already see you welling up. I know. <laughs> I, 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 I understand. I understand some people. You know, they may have a, a certain level of, of disdain for the for that project. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. However, you have to say that later on down the line, you still gonna remember it. Mm -hmm. You have a reaction to it. I'm sorry. I mean, think about it. Think but about it. But what am I remembering it for, though? Well, I mean, hey, here's, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I agree. It's a way, the whole thing right now, it's about cutting through the clutter. Mm. Look how many artists there are, period, right? So the minute that you hear something, look how many things you heard on your way here, and you don't even remember what you heard. Right. But when you hear a song that, that, invokes a reaction like any that. song off you any type of song that invokes a reaction you gonna feel a certain way about it mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying but, and but see it was just about that album i felt the production more so than the actual like pablo i'm full-blown rolling with i'm like why couldn't that same consistency be there why did that have to be a valley when it could have just been on par with all the peaks you knocked out like, i i get what you're saying I really at, don't at, see the, too much at the same time though as an artist and, and as a, a creative genius that is Kanye, you got to understand that he's not going to be in one place all the time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So he's all Sonically, over the place. Lyrically. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. If you listen to, if you listen to, uh, um, like Jesus, the, the whole sound of it, it was an in your face, distorted yeah. mix. Everything was kind of distorted to whereas 808s, that was more singy. So his mix and everything was completely different. So when I when I listen to something from him, I understand that every single aspect of it means something. So you know what, what did saying? you pull from from that aspect of it? What did you pull to get this song out of you, man? I really fuck with this song. Hey man, I really appreciate it, Real man. I, I I um truth be told, man, I've been I've been doing this for a minute. Okay. And the funny thing is, I've been doing it so long that at a time I kind of lost myself mm -hmm. I got lost in trying to be relevant I got lost in trying to oh you know what I need to I need a song that sound like that man come on y'all let's do something like that you know I need something this is what's hot right now I need to do that and that was my downfall a lot of people don't admit that man right. yeah you know what I'm saying that was my downfall and so I said you know what bro I'm really getting ready to just go all the way with what I feel. Whatever the hell I want to do, whatever I feel, that's what I'm going to do. So let me ask you this. After you pull from your inspiration, uh -huh. you, you, you lay down the track. Yeah. When do you make the call to Hawk? Like, Hawk, I got to play this to you. When, when do you know it's ready, man? When do you make that call? You know what? I knew it, I knew it when it was bouncing down okay. in the studio and some other cats walked in and was like, Hey, what the hell is that? Bro, I know. You know what I'm saying? And then in my mind, you know, this is something that I that I, you know, came with, came up with in my in my truck. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So in my mind, I don't really wrap my mind around like, oh yeah, they 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 fuck with it heavy. Yeah. It's just one of them things where I was just like, oh, okay, yeah. Oh, you you like it? Oh, cool. Thank you, man. Oh, you like it too? Thank you. Time to make the call. And after a while, I was just yeah. like, okay, this might be something. And then that's when I hit him, you know. What, what if they didn't like it? What if they was like, ah, man, what the fuck is that? I wouldn't give a fuck. Got it. <laughs> At all. Enough At said. all. Right. I wouldn't Enough give said. two fucks. Because that's what said. I was feeling that's at the time. It was supposed to be. 
And that's Kanye shit. My daughter, my <laughs> my daughter was on that. Was that her in the video? Yeah. Bless you, man. Yeah, thank yeah. you, bro. Respect. My my daughter came to my session that night, and she was so just she was just so thrown back mm -hmm. by you go in there and then your voice is out here and how do you get it on this is how That's you make dad. a song dad <laughs> dad this is how you make a song oh well oh, how, how do you do it mm -hmm. and i knew that was her way of telling me like i, I, I want to get in there Absolutely. you know what i'm saying so that just me putting her on that and her being there and that magic happening that night the song already went for me she made the track and the video who? Was she in the video too? Yeah. She was in the video yeah. and at the end of the track, right? Yep. Yeah, you made the song yep. in the video. That's it, man. Superstar. Got it. <laughs> All right, bro. Bibi. Yeah. We're in the day and age, bro, where quote unquote everybody's a rapper. Like, once you tell it to somebody or to try to get somebody to listen to your music. Yeah. But if you have to pitch yourself to somebody and say what would basically set you apart from the next rapper, what would you um, tell somebody? Huh. Uppercut. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. <laughs> you know what? I'ma be real. I wouldn't I wouldn't tell anybody anything. I just press play. Mm. Because the minute the minute that you start talking, man, of course you're gonna say that about yourself. I don't give a damn what you say about yourself. I wanna hear what he got to say about you. I wanna hear what this man got to say about you. Story. You know what I'm saying? You go into a job interview, you gonna always big yourself up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's the reason why they take your resume and then call your references. Whether it be, damn, that's crazy. Subconscious you know or conscious. <laughs> exactly. Would rather hear what somebody exactly that value that opinion. And you know how many niggas crazy. came up to me on Venice Beach was like, "Yo, man, I'm the hottest. I'm the dopest." Hey, listen to me. Trust me. You won't be. Jesus you ain't gonna be disappointed, man. <laughs> hey, I promise, man. I hey. Why not? <laughs> hey. I mean. You, you gotta, it's, it's the like, same shit like the nigga selling his CD on Crenshaw's last day at the Royal Shopping Center. Well, and, and shout out, <laughs> like, I'm not knocking nobody's husband. I'm not knocking nobody's husband. The thing is, I'm not selling it. I'm not selling it. He's listening. He's listening. He's listening right now. Pissed off. How do you get your music out to the people? I'm not knocking that. People like Guys, 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 guys. I'm going to listen to it. Let's go ahead and take these cards. We don't want to want them too long. these cards. <laughs> no, you on the air with the only hip hop show with the only hip hop squad with Comedy. What What's your name? Where you calling from? Yo, yo, this is KO, bro. I'm out here in uh, Long Beach. What's Long good? Beach, what LBC. I what it do? Amazing. What's up with it? Man, man, my dude is doing his thing, bro. We got love for my nigga. I hear y'all chopping it up about the whole uh, what you do. Consistency, man. Consistency. A lot of niggas could put out a dope record. Niggas can find that gold, but that consistency is what shows, bro. My nigga right. got that shit. Right. Yeah. Yeah. What, what's your name, man? Where you say? Yo, I'm this KO. KO, right? You LBC. KO. KO. We, we ain't did this in a long time, Shar. Let's bring it back one time. Let, let's get this pop quiz out of here, man. <laughs> so, KO, before you leave, man, we got to ask you a secret question, brother. You ready? What's that? What's your favorite hip hop album, man? Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I'm an 86 baby. I'm not going to lie. I'm okay. a bar dude. I love bars. So I'm going to honestly say it's probably a toss up between the Carter 1 and Carter 2. That's, that's oh, easy. You win. Hey, you win. Hey, you win that's with me, man. I'll take those that's all good, the way, man. I thank you so much that's for showing good, love and your support, man. Please stay tuned all the way. We got Derek Lou coming up. We got a show and tell coming up. We're going to show down every Tuesday, 930, bro. Please. Yeah, yeah, hot, my nigga, hot, DB, fam. I see y'all, bro. What's up with it, boy? What you want to do, LP? We going to the next one. Let's get it. Caller, you on the air with the only hip hop show, with the only hip hop squad with cops and DB. What's your name? Where you calling from? Hello, P. You looking nice, man. Yo. Caller, shirt. Hey, it's your cousin, man, from Compton. What's up, man? What's going on, DB? <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. Yeah, man. Just call it and say, keep grinding, keep hustling, dog. Oh, man, I appreciate it, man. You already know. Oh, yeah. Good, good. Hey, uh, y'all be on the lookout for Don't Doubt It. That's my next thing. Don't Doubt It video is coming out, man. Kev had a cameo in that, man. So let me go. There you go. There's your plug, bro. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Thank you for All calling right, in, man. Love. DB, what's your favorite album, bro? Hey, don't even, you can't even get me started, man. Hey, man we we're going to get you started. I'm going to be real with you, though. 
Are you you gonna limit me to a genre? Nah, or bro. You no, no. Oh, Anything. Bro. All right, because I don't. Might as well, you might as well throw a book in there too. So you know, <laughs> yeah, throw a book in there. Hey, homie. man. Hey, I, I'm telling you, man. Contagious by Jonah Burger, man. That right there. Okay. Google right now. Hey. Right. <laughs> Thank you. I'm like, wait, what'd you hey. say? It's, what it's called it? Contagious. It's by, I think it's Jonah Berger or Berger. It's, it's hey, Google Berger. gonna correct it. It don't matter. Hmm. Yeah. B E R G E R. Yeah, Berger. Yeah, but as far as y- you wanna know something, man, hip hop is so many, but I got to really, really. Jonah Berger. Jonah Burger, there it is. Yeah, it should be an orange cover with like a dandelion on yep, the front. Of it. Yep. All right, now I got a question for you. If you was to break it up into like increments of four, bro, what would you say is the best period of hip hop from your perspective since you've been listening to music? Give me a good answer. Oh, you said in increments of four? Yeah, just like like hypothetically from ninety nine. I mean ninety five to ninety nine, ninety nine to two thousand three, like that. Mm, damn. <laughs> That's hard. That's hard. Cause uh I gotta be real, man. When when volume two came out, mm-hmm. it changed my life. Well, uh, Jay-Z. When Hard Knock Life came out, that changed my life. So that's like 98, 7, 98. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And at that time, that's when I was full fledged, like every day, you know, going across the street to my to my partner's house and we would like rap on this on his patio and he had like this cassette tape. When we record into the cassette tape oh, yeah. with a CD player playing oh, into yeah. the cassette tape. It was like some weird bootleg oh, shit, yeah. but we was making it work. And at that time, man, so really I'll have to say like like from probably like 98 to 2002. I dig that that's, that's when I was really like the nostalgia. I'm tied up in the nostalgia at that time. Okay. Cause you, you Three stacks. About the bur- oh, Andre, okay. Andre 3000, though. That's, that's my dude. So. I'm about to be on you. I'm about to be on you if you didn't tell us to go to break. You know the coordinator not here. You got to hold us down. <laughs> so tell us to go to break. Good and pee. Good and pee. Good and pee. <laughs> hey.